It's a very exciting day in Friday Adventure Club history. I'm making a hat. This is the first sample. I think it's gonna be a little bit smaller than this. I've already got my art uploaded to the machine, so we're ready to go. So I've never actually embroidered anything for Freddy Adventure Club or any of my other projects. So this is kind of my first time learning all about it. Oh, oh my God. you're gonna be in my video. But like for this hat, one color thread, upload the file to some service or you can do it yourself. And that basically just changes your artwork into something that the machine can read. And then for something like this, that has multiple colors, your artwork will be interpreted in whichever way makes the most sense. So in this case, there's a red, a black and a white and it works together to make a dark red, a pink, and of course you can choose from all types of different garments. And these are just a few that we have here in the shop. So heading on over to the machine, this one has eight heads. You can do eight hats at once, and then ideally you'll have another eight ready to go. It's hard to tell, but this thing is pretty big, like car sized, and I happen to have a great video of when we brought it in here on the forklift it wasn't sketchy at all. Okay, we're gonna let Arturo do his thing and here's what we've got going on on this side of the shop. Okay, we're making some progress on the hats. I'll show you what it looks like on the screen, on the embroidery machine. It's cool, you can kind of trace where the needle's going and what's been done and what needs to be done still. Let's take a look. It's pretty loud. If you're embroidering something for yourself, this might also factor into cost and time and stuff like that. My design is 4,600 stitches, 4,600 times the needle has to go in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Here you go, 4,643 stitches. Oh, nice. So to get the hats on the machine, you have to first put it on a hoop, put that onto one of those, put on your hat, flip it over, Oh, ho, ho. nice. <laughs> there we go. And once everything's all set up, it's time for the next round. I gotta throw this in here because it's kind of funny. The shop where I work, this building right here, it's called Midnight Supply Company. There is a shipping line called like Mediterranean Shipping Company or something, I think. They have containers, like shipping containers. So it's funny, we'll see the shipping containers that say MSC. Well, somebody found a tiny shipping container with the MSC on it. Love it. So there you have it, making some hats. And by we, I mean Arturo. But I did make some shirts and those are already up on the site. I don't have an actual shirt. I have this like torn caveman looking piece of fabric that I found. But that's the design. The picture that I took of Seattle from Jose Rizal Park. If you ever visit, you should definitely go there. But I hand printed these myself. So shirts are on the site, hats are soon to be on the site. Working on another shirt design, a lot of people wanted like a black shirt or a different design. So we'll see what we can do about that. And I'm actually filming this video on a Friday for once. So um, that's gotta be worth something. So I think that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you learned something. I'll have a link to shirts and hats in the subscription or oh God, description, not subscription. Lunchtime.